the Bradley Fighting Vehicle and the M1 Abrams main battle tank systems are two of the primary offensive weapons of the U.S. Army. The soldiers who keep the electronics, electro-optics, and analog digital converters of sophisticated weapons such as these in top operating condition are the men and women of Military Occupational Specialty Automated Test Systems Operator Maintainer. Since these systems are classified, you must qualify for a secret security clearance in order to be assigned this vital military occupational specialty. Successful candidates for this MOS include those interested in mathematics and working with electronic equipment, have a high attention to detail, and are interested in solving problems. This job is important because this job encapsulates the electronical side of the operations of tank maneuverability, firepower, and optics. Here at the schoolhouse, we teach students basic electronics as well as signal tracing and how to read schematics on electrical components. We test the internal components of the tanks and we ensure that they work properly so that way the tanks can do what they need to do. After successfully completing 10 weeks of Army basic combat training, you will attend advanced individual training at Fort Lee, Virginia, where you will train in the use of the integrated family of test equipment and the electro-optic test facility. You'll also learn to troubleshoot your own equipment. The phase of training that they seem to find rewarding are when we go out to the field and they realize that the job they did in the shop actually works out in the field. Additionally, you will learn how to install supported weapon system test program sets, initiate unit under test procedures, isolate printed circuit board or component malfunctions, and replace defective parts and components. You will also train to perform preventive maintenance checks and services, and operational checks on assigned vehicles and power generators. After your initial entry training and advanced individual training, you will work supporting military operations around the world. I chose this MOS because I was very interested in being able to work with electrical systems and circuit boards, and be able to say that I worked on the M1 Abrams and Bradley fighting vehicle. I reclassed and chose this MOS because I wanted to work with electronics. Electronics makes way more sense to me than anything else. You may also set up a base shop test facility where your duties may consist of testing, repairing, and calibrating components of the weapon systems. As an automated test equipment operator maintainer, you may qualify for additional education to gain your Electronics Technician Association certification. Serving as an automated test systems operator maintainer can help you transition from the military to the civilian employment sector because your skills in leadership, teamwork, and problem solving are in demand by civilian employers. You may find civilian employment with manufacturing companies, medical research facilities, satellite communications firms, commercial airline companies, or work for manufacturers that design, build, and test weapon systems for the military. The skills learned here can translate to the civilian sector by obtaining certain certifications such as the AC, DC, and CET certifications. If you like working hands-on inside computers, finding the problem and fixing the problem, and being a good portion of our fighting systems, this job is for you. So take the challenge to keep the Army's most advanced weapons in top operating condition while setting yourself up for success in Military Occupational Specialty Automated Test Equipment Operator Maintainer.